हेलो एवरीबॉडी होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग ग्रेट वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल ट्रस्ट मी गाइज आई थिंक दिस इज़ वन ऑफ द मोस्ट डिमांडेड वीडियोज ऑन माई चैनल सो फार फॉर दिस ईयर आई हैव बिन गेटिंग मल्टीपल रिक्वेस्ट रिगार्डिंग द माइक्रो प्रेजेंटेशन टॉपिक्स फॉर दिस ईयर सो फाइनली गाइज हेयर इज द वीडियो दैट यू गाइज आर बिन वेटिंग फॉर इन दिस वीडियो आई विल ट्राई कवरिंग ईच एंड एवरी थिंग रिगार्डिंग माइक्रो प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ हाउ यू नीड टू प्रिपेयर रिगार्डिंग डी कोडिंग माइक्रो प्रेजेंटेशन सेशन रिगार्डिंग द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स एंड अ लॉट ऑफ एफ ए क्यूज दैट आई हैव रिसीव फ्रॉम ऑल यू पीपल सो गाइज नो मैटर वॉट एवर कोर्स यू आर अपलाइंग एट क्राइस्ट यूनिवर्सिटी प्लीज मेक श्योर दैट यू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द वेरी एंड ट्रस्ट मी दिस इज गोइंग बी ऑफ ग्रेट वैल्यू एडिशन टू ऑल यू पीपल ऑल राइट इन केस इफ यू गाइज हैवेंट ऑलरेडी इफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर योर माइक्रो प्रेजेंटेशन प्लीज गो वॉच माई प्रीवियस टू वीडियोज रिगार्डिंग माइक्रो प्रेजेंटेशन आई एम प्रिटी श्योर लॉट ऑफ यू पीपल हु आर ऑलरेडी वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो वुड हैव ऑलरेडी डन सो फार बट इन केस इफ यू हैवेंट इन वन आउट ऑफ दीज टू वीडियोज आई हैव ऑलरेडी गिव आउट a sample answer of how exactly a micro presentation should be and in the second one i've given you guys various tips of how you need to prepare for micro presentation and what are its various do's and don'ts i will be putting down the link in the description to both these videos so make sure you watch both of them very nicely next up is my decoding micro presentation session guys decoding micro presentation session is why one on one personal mentoring session just dedicated to micro presentations a lot of your seniors who made it through christ university last year had taken these sessions with me and a lot of you people who are already preparing for christ university have taken these sessions for me these are my personal sessions and i guess this is the best way when it comes to preparing you guys for the micro presentations uh micro presentations guys is generally not everybody's strong forte and this session will really help you work on your weaknesses in the best possible manner uh in this session i share with you guys all the tips tricks strategies nuances various ways of how you need to start the micro presentation various ways of how you can end the micro presentation what are the various pointers that you can use that will help you what are the topics that i think might come on your micro presentation for all those things guys a uh, one on one session will be of really good use to you uh, a lot of you people who have anxiety issues who are struggling with communication skills who do not know uh, what should we speak how should we start the micro presentation what if we go wrong what if we say the wrong things and various other things this micro presentation session guys will be of great use to all you people uh, this is a full 30 minute session i will be putting down the link in the description so make sure you click on that link and book up your personal session with me the moment you book up my team will get in touch with you and they will mutually decide the time for the video conference where you and i will be present for the micro presentation session uh trust me guys i'm repeating it again it's going to be of great worth to all you people and make sure you book these sessions with me and make the most of this available great resource okay guys so over the past few weeks i have received a lot of questions from your all you people regarding micro presentation so i thought of covering the faqs in this particular video itself the first question that i have received is can you ask for a topic change that means can you ask the interviewers for the topic change the answer to that is yes in fact interviewers would prefer if you ask for a topic change rather than averagely going on to speak about a topic which you don't know about so if guys so in case guys if you have no clue about the topic that the interviewers have given to you or you know you don't know whether you have the right points or not you can tell the interviewers that sir ma'am i'm really sorry i've not really studied about this topic or i'm not really sure or confident on this topic could you please change the topic and interviewers can give you another topic the second question that i've got is is micro presentation and interview together to answer that guys yes they are together a lot of people have the misconception that for interviews there is going to be a different time and date and for micro presentations there is going to be a completely different time and date so that's not the truth guys uh in trice university will send you a link uh, you have to join on that link and that link is both for your interviews and the micro presentations the two interviewers who will be taking your interview will be the faculty members of trice university and they will only be judging you for your micro presentation the third doubt that i've received a lot is there a possibility that we don't have a micro presentation so guys in terms of the admission criteria there is a proper criteria mentioned for micro presentations and that you would find on the christ university's website in each and every uh, course profile 
However, yes, there is a possibility that you don't have a micro presentation because at the end of the day, interviewers are the deciders there. And if they feel that they don't need to take your micro presentation, uh, they wouldn't take it. Now, there could be multiple reasons of it. And I've seen a lot of times uh, students who do not have micro presentation in their real interview panic a lot and they are super scared of, oh my God, bhaiya, they didn't ask me the micro presentation. Will I get rejected or what will happen? Why did they not ask me? Was I not doing good? All that. So guys, relax. There could be multiple reasons of why they would not take the micro presentation for you. Uh, so, and you rather than thinking too much about it, you guys should wait for the real results to come out. Uh, it could definitely be that you are doing superbly well in your interview, and interviewers don't feel the need of unnecessarily asking you uh, for a micro presentation because they feel that your communication skills are good, your knowledge is good, and they don't need to specifically give you a specific topic. Secondly, it can also be that even if you are doing average and they should be judging you, they are in a hurry and the time is short. Hence, they avoid the micro presentation. Sometimes it can also happen that you, they might not officially announce that this is a micro presentation topic. Maybe in the interview when they're discussing things with you, they might just randomly tell you that, okay, you know, what kind of leader do you like? And, you know, you can go on to talk about, so this is the leader I like and this and that. Uh, and, you know, then they would say, okay, bye. And you would uh, and they, you would feel that they haven't asked you for a specific micro presentation, but you wouldn't have even realized that the leader related question was your micro presentation topic. So that can also happen. And yes, definitely there is a possibility that you might be doing really bad in your interview and interviewers again don't feel the need of asking you for a micro presentation because they would know that even if you know you bomb your micro presentation you might not make it through Christ so all of those different permutations and combinations could exist so please you guys don't worry too much about it you give your best shot prepare for the micro presentation in the best possible manner uh, and let's leave the rest on God and how you know it really happens on the real final day now the next and the last doubt I've got is when should we book the decoding micro presentation? So guys, the answer to that is you guys should book the decoding micro presentation session as soon as possible. Why am I asking that is even though I know that you have about 20, 30 days left for your real Christ University interview and the whole admission process, I would want you to book it up as soon as possible because the earlier you come to me the better you will have with your preparation because in this personal session i would not only be telling you all the tips tricks i would also be taking micro presentations from you so you would have to give me various micro presentations on the topics that i feel can come on your micro presentation and after each every micro presentation that i ask you to speak i will be giving you guys a sample answer so the more sample answers you would hear from me the more confident you would become of how ideally you are required to go for a micro presentation and you know what all things you could say and all that and after that definitely you can prepare on by yourself but once you've taken these sessions to me with me trust me guys it will be a great asset so a lot of people your competitors peers have already booked these sessions from me and i've already taken these sessions and i've pre started preparing on their own for micro presentations so make sure you don't miss this out and book it up as soon as possible i will be putting down the link in the description of these decoding micro presentation session finally guys here it is this time i'm bringing you guys the list of fresh 60 topics which i feel can come on this year's micro presentation sessions across various courses or across various interviews now guys this resource is completely free of course please do not indulge yourself in either of any selling or purchasing of this document this guy this document is completely free for all my subscribers on the youtube so all those who are watching this video this uh, this uh, this list is completely free for all you people. I want you to share this with as many friends and people who are preparing for Christ University. Uh, along with that, guys, this is just for practice. So again, I don't guarantee that uh, only a topic out of this list can come up. Any topic could come up from any list. Like definitely, but last year, from my last year's list, majority of the topics came on the real interview. So I can expect that this year as well. But again, this is just for practice. In terms of practice, I would want you guys to focus more on the topics that are relatable to you and to your course. So, you know, I have made this list keeping in mind various courses offered at Christ University from law to psychology to journalism to, you know, BBA to BCom, all that. So not all the topics may be valid for you. In terms of practice, yes, you guys should definitely go through the, 
the complete list of the 60 topics but when you are practicing on like hardcore topics make sure you pick it up something related to your course so like if you're going for a bba course you know that more of business related topics are more suitable for you uh, if you're going for journalism then maybe something related to media and journalism and freedom of speech uh, may be more relatable to you uh, at the same time if you're going for psychology then you know something related to like mental health peer pressure suicides that may be more relatable for you so make sure you pick those topics out first but yes please have a look at all the 60 topics that i have put out on this list along with that guys please refer the previous list as well so now guys this 60 topics are not the only topics last year and last last year i bought about 100 topics each so in total now you have the reserve of 260 topics and you should look at them uh, and definitely skim through all of them i don't want you to please learn 260 topics that's humanely impossible don't even try learning these 60 topics that's also humanely impossible but yeah make sure that you go through this list and you know in the back of your mind you you know keep uh, running your brain head that you know in case if this topic comes what are you going to say and in case if that topic comes what you're going to say uh, as a token of love please make sure you subscribe to my channel so yes guys uh, collecting this list of 60 topics is not very easy it took me a lot of while i also had to get approvals uh, from you know a lot of people that i discussed you know with uh, about what topics would come i also had to take about like references and help from the faculty members of who could advise me one or two topics here and there uh, which might come on the real day so i want you guys uh, to please respect this resource of mine at the same time as again a love of token and appreciation i would really urge you guys to subscribe to my channel in case if you haven't already it would mean a lot to me so yes guys that's about it for this particular video thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please smash the like button please comment below if you have any doubts question queries Please book up your decoding micro presentation sessions as soon as possible so that I can help you prepare for micro presentations in the best possible manner. Trust me guys, I don't think so there's any better asset in terms of preparing for micro presentations than my personal sessions. Last but not the least guys, please subscribe to the channel. I'll see you soon with another video. Take care guys. Bye bye.